yourself um, download a picture of your Christmas uh, stocking from the internet and cut it out. Then make a template. Oops. Make a template out of cardboard. Uh, Draw then, around that on your belt. Then when you've got 24 of these, cut, uh, sorry, 20, 48 of these, because there's one either side. Uh, then you need to do the white tops, so you'll need 24 of these. And again, I cut the top off here, made a cardboard template, and then cut 24. So once you've got the templates, then set your, um, I'll set my sewing machine up with a variegated red, and then do the same.
So these are the completed 24. Obviously you don't need one for Christmas Day because that's the morning you get up and open all your presses. Uh, so you can get the kids to help you with these. Um, it was easy enough. I happen to have numbers that I could do on my Sizzix, uh, but you could do that with um, a pen, a permanent pen or a felt tip pen, anything, uh, or, or you might have something different to do. Anyway, and then next thing to do, we string them together. So there it is. There you go, that's just to show you how long it is. And it's all the way across there and to there. And it's number from 124, and obviously they're all mixed up. And um, it makes a good garland or decoration once you're finished because all of its colours. You can make this out of, I've made it out of everything that I've got in. I've not bought anything because I'm determined to get rid of all the stash I've got. This, uh, this year and the half, first half of next year. And there you go. So if you've got time during the holiday, you can make 2021s. 20, um, Christmas calendar. There you go. Thank you for joining me. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe and when I have any more videos you will be notified when I put them up. Thank you for joining me. Bye bye. Have a Merry Christmas and have fun.